Good afternoon, everybody. This is Karen Martz. All right, guys, we've got a black vulture per uh, perched on top of a telephone pole, and then we've got two of the black vultures flying around. Now, black vultures, they're, they're not all over the U.S., uh, more of the southeast, uh, I think a little bit more west, and so, so far we have three vultures. This is a double crested cormorant. And a lot of people getting confused with the anhingas, but the cormorant has a very interesting tail. But they have a very beautiful yellow beak. And you see at the end of the beak, there there's like a, how do I say it? Curved downward. Um, probably to hook fish, I would imagine. Oh, look at this. Now, guys, it's only 68 degrees. I almost wish I had a little coat on. But, this bird is practicing what's called guller fluttering. G-U-L-A-R fluttering. So, because it's overheated right now, it's moving uh, the skin around the neck really fast. It, kind of like a dog that does panting. So, it's a, it's a cooling mechanism. And look at the beautiful eyes. It's very pretty blue um like a turquoise if i could hold the camera still so again guller fluttering keeps the birds cool and then check this out so we got two double crested cormorants we got three vultures and of course beautiful day we got an alligator this is an american alligator uh the only crocodiles in the usa would be down in florida that's gonna be the american crocodile and these are scoots. They're going to soak up the rays of the sun. And keep in mind, alligators do not eat food um, from October all the way to April. Can you believe that? They can live on 90 pounds of food a year. Hardly anything. I, I probably eat that much in a week. Kidding. Woo! Gotta love it. All right, guys. Beautiful day here in Sea Pines Plantation. Have a great day. 